this is a Death in Boccia. I purchased it at uh, Walmart. It was half price because there was a lot of leaf damage. Pretty plant. Can't wait till it looks healthy again. So, don't cut off your leaves. Wait until they fall off naturally. And, I think that that's probably why people aren't saying that they know how to prune them. Because it's, you don't need to prune them. Just pull the dead leaves off once they're yellow or brown, just pull them off. But don't pull them off sooner or you'll hurt your plant. <coughs> if you know of any other tips or tricks to this, Defimbachida, then you can put them down there in the comments. Yes. If you cut off the leaves before, it's time to cut them off. You're going to get this. It'll start pretty much bleeding. It'll, it's like the, the liquid's coming straight out of the plant. And it'll leak all over your leaves. That's all drop what that came from there. And this stuff is, I guess, uh, you're not supposed to put it on your skin. It causes skin irritations. And uh, I believe on one website it says that uh, you can lose your, loss, uh, lose your speech. I'm not sure if that's a temporary or permanent speech loss, but it's one of the symptoms of this, or side effects of this juice. But yeah. as it continuous stays like this, all the liquid goes up in there. And I didn't know this at the time, but whenever I bought this four days ago, I clipped off some damaged leaves, about six of them. So, this uh, plant juice was been, has been leaking all over my plant. And so what I had to do is singe the part that I cut to keep it from spilling over. I used the soldering iron to do that. And I got two more to finish here, and I was going to do that on camera so you guys can see how I'm doing it. But, um, uh, it's not a good idea to do this, I don't think so. I think it's better just to leave it. Leave the leaves on there, even though they're ugly, and let them fall off by themselves. Got the soldering iron. I'm just kind of pushing the sides in, kind of fold them over as much as possible. And it takes a while to do this because I've already went over these other ones I'm going to keep going over them until there's no no more liquid coming out of them <coughs> since I'm burning these these will, this will probably affect the way this plant grows in the future on this side but I think it's better to go ahead and close them up than to leave them open and let the plant waste its energy on fixing them. Okay. Has to 
be burned really good. Like that liquid is just, I mean, it, it's like it's trying to heal itself. So hopefully this will like help the scab over to let the plant grow again. See, I've already burned this one and it's still still getting a little help from the plant. You gotta be careful not to jab that down in there too much. You don't want to damage the plant more than it's already damaged. The idea is just to kind of repair the damage that you've done by pulling, cutting the leaves off. Now, we're just going to have to look at this black stuff for a while until it covers by new growth.